Hello everyone, I am at Animal Kingdom for the next few hours because I don't have work till 7.45 p.m. So I'm going to do the usual, my few fast passes that I booked last night, and then Rafiki's Planet Watch, which is the last attraction I have to do while I'm on my college program. Hakuna Matata! What a wonderful phrase! Hakuna Matata! Ain't no person craze! It means no worries for the rest of your days. It's our problem-free philosophy. Hakuna Matata. Entering Rafiki's Planet Watch. Here we are, look at all the animals. I think I've only been here once or twice before. I'm going to wait in line to meet that Rafiki over there. So I just met Rafiki and now I'm headed to the affection section. Look at all the goats. I want to pet one. Oh wow. Oh my gosh, the kids are trying to get in. Oh, you do. Can I have that on? Be lunchtime. Oh, there's more. There's. There might be donkeys. I don't know my animals. I mean, that's a cow. Oh, it smells like stinky. There are pigs over here. <laughs> They're so funny. They all have poop on the ground too. Is that an alpaca? Hi! Thanks for coming! Well, welcome you guys. My name is Rebecca. I'm one of the keepers that works over here at Conservation Station. The team that I'm a part of, we can take care of all the mammals and the birds that you guys see in this area. So that includes all the sheep and the goats and the donkeys and the cow over here that you guys get to interact with. The tamarins that you guys saw when you got off the train. And then we also have a very large group of animals back behind the scenes that you only get to see during encounters like this one right here. So I have brought out one of my very special little friends. All right, Austin, it's showtime, so it's time to wake up, which is not going to probably happen because Austin does what ferrets do best, which is sleep. So he's going to be very tired and very sleepy. Because these guys do generally sleep about 16 to 18 hours. I like to think of them a lot like cats in that sense. In your home, which we call caching. They're also very good at getting into the animals. In order to hunt those guys, have to be able to get into those dens. Hey guys, so I just met Doug and Russell. And I'm going to be headed out in a little bit. So see you real soon.